Nicolette, you have a big decision to make. You have a chance to win a whole lot more money because you can risk any portion of your $3,000 on a final question. But if you put it all on the line and you get it correct, I will give you five times that amount for $15,000. <laughs> However, Nicolette, if you go all in and you get it wrong, you fall all the way down to $1,000. It's a bit of a loss, but it's up to you. What does Austin think? Well, Austin, you know, he's 18 and he jumped out of a, uh, an airplane this weekend, so he's definitely an all-in kind of person. Okay. Right. Well, I'm not normally an all-in kind of person. However, the difference between $3,000 and $1,000 is not going to change my life. It would be great money, but... I'm gonna be one of those crazy people that I see on TV all the time and think, wow, they're insane. And I'm gonna say, all in. Austin's rubbing off on ya. Nicolette is going all in, $3,000 on the line. That means, Nicolette, if you get this last question correct, you will win $15,000. Good luck, Nicolette. <laughs> We're all pulling for you. Here we go. For $15,000, here are the four possible answers. We've got threaten, bribe, distract, or ignore. Nicolette, the final question is, what did dads say is the best way to deal with their kids' temper tantrum? Possible answers are threaten, bribe, distract, or ignore. What did dads say is the best way to deal with their kids' temper tantrums? Nicolette has earned $3,000 playing the game. This is the final question of the entire show. She's chosen to go all in for a shot at $15,000. If she's right, the money's hers. If she's wrong, she drops down to $1,000. All right. How do you feel, I, Nicolette? Are you, are you confident with this question or not? You know, I am confident with what the correct answer is. I am not confident with what dad's say the correct answer is. <laughs> well, let's start with what do you think the correct answer is, regardless of the dads? What do you think? Right. Um, well, I was an elementary school teacher with first graders, and I will definitely say the best way to stop ta temper tantrums forever is to ignore them, because it keeps going for a while, but then it stops. So that's really good. Okay. <laughs> I did not say ignore, because I don't think that's what most dads would do. I have to look at what I said. Okay. I do not think distract would work because I think they would think, all right, I can distract them for a second, but then it's gonna go away. Threaten, I don't think they would own up to. So I'm gonna say most dads are gonna be like, have a Barbie, have something, here's some chocolate. Just stop. <laughs> I'll give you whatever you want, just be quiet. Stop. Question was, what did dad say is the best way to deal with their kids' temper tantrums? Nicolette, you earned $3,000. You put it all on the line for a shot at 15,000. If you're right, you got the money. If you're wrong, you leave with $1,000, which is still not too shabby. With 42% of the vote, Nicolette, dad said the best way to deal with their kids' temper tantrum was to ignore it. Oh, oh man was to ignore it. You had it right. You might have overthought it a little bit. Unfortunately, you lose a couple bucks, Nicolette, but you still get $1,000 for playing a game from your house.